Hello, all my fellow actors and allies. No living here. Calling from a hospital in Chicago. As you see out the win that hospital window, it's no couple inches here the, the other day. Not too cold outside, but I'm glad I'm not out there. <laughs> Recovering from knee surge. From knee replacement I had Thursday. <laughs> Ugh, man, it was painful too. It was a success, all. Doc says it went pretty good. It took about two hours for the knee to be replaced. He said, I really needed it because of all that arthritis in there. <laughs> you see maybe that furry thing on that chair there. They put my leg in there and it manipulates my leg so it stretches it out and, <laughs> and unbends it in a very painful way. Ugh. I call it my t personal torture device. And they gave me this because all the morphine they're giving me for the pain. I gotta keep my breathing exercises up too. They, want, they said they want get me getting pneumonia or respiratory failure because of the morphine. And boy, do I need that morphine. <laughs> and the backup is my Norco. But that doesn't work as well as morphine, though. But helps just enough. <laughs> That's right, Mr. Peabottle. <laughs> well, I can't get to the bathroom, so I gotta use that. <laughs> Ugh. This leg will be just like this one. In about a little over a month, I'll be getting this replaced, too been suggested I get both replaced at the same time, but I'm glad I didn't because this is bad enough as it is. I mean, I mean the pain, look in the chart there. You see right there in that chart. Maybe you zoom in on it. Scale, it's a Richter scale of one to 10 for pain. And right now I'm on my six right now. <laughs> but it's been, it's been as high as eight on the chart. And, ugh, maybe Moan and Grant was at that level. It was shortly after the surgery was done. And about a day after, again, it was up to that level eight. But I'm usually be hovering around f six and seven in the pain department. Uh, thank goodness for painkillers. <laughs> I'd be going crazy. Ugh. And so much pain, I haven't been really eating that much in the hospital either. Mm. But they got good staff here. I'm, I've been, been blessed with good staff here. All the nurses, technicians, and the doctors, and the therapists. I mean, they've been treated to, to no limit pretty good. So I guess I can't complain too much. Ugh. <laughs> Those sexy legs. <laughs> maybe if you're a gorilla, maybe. <laughs> oh. Say 30 here on a Sunday morning. Bore stiff on my mind. Really nothing on TV. It's basic cables. I was watching the football games yesterday. I'll be watching more today too as well. I got a few of my friends of the congregation have been visiting me. Visiting me. One gave me a balloon and hope that's prophetic there because I <laughs> I want to get well real soon. <laughs> Ugh. Let's see what else. Uh, not much to go on, but I've been watching some of you guys' videos. It's been <laughs> helping with my boredom here. <laughs> and I'm going to keep too long with this video because I'm, in, I'm in pretty much in pain and pretty soon I'm going to get some more therapy on this leg. I can't, I mean, I work this leg pretty good. That's why I can't lift. Oh. It's about as low. I I can lift it, oh, and oh man, it's painful. Believe me, and I gotta go for more pain. It's about over a month or so. I gotta see what the doc says. He says he recommends maybe wait six weeks, but it could be up to three months before I could get that done. As soon as this baby heals, uh, I was hoping to get out of here Monday, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. I've been here since since Thursday. Mm. 
And this is probably the second most painful operation I ever had. The first one was back in 89 when I had my knees crushed in between two cars pumping gas while I was a young man working at a gas station. And that's that's why I needed a knee replacement because, you know, the knee construction back then was a success. The docs said back then that I'm going to develop severe arthritis as I get older, and he was prophetic in that. So I'm going to, and as you see, I got a knee replacement, and I'm pretty soon with this one, too. Not looking forward to the pain, though. <clears throat> So guys, please keep on making videos considering accident all up because uh, I got really my board and get my A and A fix. I see some of you making global wars and war room videos. And they're they're nice, but since I don't have those games that are pretty expensive, I can't really relate to them. But they do, they look, do look interesting as soon as I. Can afford them. I'm going to buy them. I'll, I'll buy them myself, but that won't probably happen for a while. Ugh. And if you see my video from last time, my last video, <laughs> it was a shout out to uh, Viper and her husband NATO. <laughs> I got that out before I got this operation. I got that out of the way because I'm not going to be doing, cr doing any crazy videos for a while. <laughs> uh, that was the, not the pain I got go through right now. And I won't have the energy. Maybe in about, about a month, month or two, I'll make, still be making crazy videos. But I'll still be doing my turn for Germany. We're still in our global 1940 game. It's in the third round right now. We're waiting Bluegrass General's turn of China. And Hunter Jones was wasn't able to uh, do his turns lately, so Bluegrass General was kind enough to keep the game along and do his turns while he's away. And so I should I should be getting out of here somewhere this week. I don't know when. I should be doing my Germany's turn, but it's still a few players ahead of me in in that round. I think let's see got. China's got to do their turn, and Britain, Bluegrass Jones could be doing those, both those turns, and I believe Italy, which is War Party, and then what was that? I think the Anzacs and the, and, and the French, which Bluegrass General is always going, also going to have, be doing those turns too. Right after that, I'll be doing. I'll be doing a recap video of round three, and afterwards I'll do, be, do, be doing my round four turn of Germany. I, mean, I can sit down while <laughs> and record my videos. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Oh man, it's painful. Ugh. Ugh. But it's going to be worth it though. Getting sick of walking around with a cane nowadays. But as you get older, I guess that's, that's what happened. Of course, that injury back in 89 didn't help either. Otherwise, I'd be in great shape. Yeah, well, hope that well informs all you accent allers. Like, like I said again, please make him, keep making any videos, please, so I can <laughs> relieve my boredom and stress here from the hospital and while I'm at home recovering as well. Well... I don't have my, any dice here, so may all your roads be sixes when you play it against me.